my simplest way of cooking. Today we're going to make the cutlet. Okay? You need one pound of ground beef or any kind of yeah, ground meat you like. And then you need two pounds of uh, potato and one small or medium uh, onion. You just have to grate your potato and onion with this side of your grater. This side, don't forget. And if you have a food processor, just use the food processor and use that side for your food processor too. And just get it over your potato and leave it for five minutes because it has lots of water. You see it has lots of water. Okay, we're just gonna add everything together. First, we're gonna start with the potato. And just press it really well because it has lots of water. We're gonna add two eggs. Just crack your eggs. I'm just gonna use the one full teaspoon of chives. Actually, I'm gonna use two because I like chives. But you can use less. You can use one. And just a little bit of hot pepper and turmeric just a half a teaspoon and curry just like a half a teaspoon and just a little bit of black pepper a little bit of salt just a little bit for taste and just then now we're going to mix everything together mix it really well have everything have to be combined together okay you see everything is mixed but it just take you like a less than a five minutes to mix everything together now we're just going to fry our cutlet i'm just going to use the oil I just want to cover the pan. You have to wait for a little bit to get warmer. It has to be hot. We can just pick up a little bit of meat to make sure it's ready. Just drop it to see if it's ready or not. Yeah, it's ready. Now we're just gonna lower the temperature to medium high. Just takes like a handful of your meat. You have to shape it with your both hands. Shape it like a rectangle. You have to do it like this. You have to shape it. Shape your cutlet. And now you have to go to your pan. You don't have any more space just leave it you have to leave it just have to leave it for a few minutes you can tell when it's ready when you see around is like it is getting a little bit like a brown around the edges then you can just turn it to the other side you can always just the others just fill it with your meat. You see, I just turn it the other way. Okay, I just want to fill it this side to the other side. You see, this side is ready. I just fill it. You have to fill it a few times, you know. Anytime you have a little bit of space, you can just drop another. Cutlet. Never leave it empty. Never leave your pan empty. Always cover it with it till you finish with all your meat. You see, sometimes when you turn the cutlet to, to other side to fry, 
the third side is not really brown. You have to, again, you have to turn it the other side. So when that side is finished, you have to turn it back. So all getting brown, all the surface has to be brown. Some of them are not yet. That side is dirty. I just done it. I just want to be a little bit more brown. And that's why I'm just going to turn it back to the other side. I just want it for right this side too. Just hold it like this to find all the sides of the cosmetic. Okay, this one is dirty. All the content is finished. Then you see we have like a we made two cutlets and it like it take uh, almost 15 minutes to finish all of them. Then you and you can eat it with flat like you can have a non or flat bread and just with, with a slice of tomato and a slice of pickles and lettuce and or you can just eat it with rice or you can just eat it by yourself with ketchup or just by yourself thank you for watching till next episode